Well, Gary, yet again, an announcement here at Welcome to Yorkshire. The Tour de Yorkshire route has been announced. Is it starting to feel real now that we're so close to it? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's fantastic. Uh, you know, we've got six fantastic starts and finishes. Uh, really, really pleased. Really pleased with the mix and just seeing them on the map, how that all looks. I think it's fantastic. Looking at the process of picking these areas, obviously you know so, some of them so, so well through what they've done before, so you know their strengths and benefits. And you've also got a couple of new ones there where they've had one or two goes but for this one it'll be a new one for them yeah you know we've got three three places that we've not actually done a start or a finish before so we're really uh, pleased about that uh, we're delighted to be going to Bradford into the centre of Bradford that will be good um, delighted for Fox Valley just outside of Sheffield um, and Tadcast you know Tadcast has had a tough time of it and so if we can help in some way by bringing our bike race there either for a start or a finish that would be that would be good news you look at the floods of Tadcaster and how many people have been affected by them. This is the kind of boost, though, that will help people know that Tadcaster's back in the map and back up and running. Yeah, that's the idea, you know, getting images of Tadcaster going around the world, 165 countries live on television, that can only be good news. And looking at Bradford and it being in the city centre this time, I know it's been there before, but never in the heart yeah, of the city centre. Yeah, we'll be, we've been to Bradford to the district before on, on numerous occasions, but we haven't actually done anything right in the heart of the city. This will change, and that will be a great thing, I think, for Bradford, for Bradfordians, and for the race. Now, you've said that 15 areas applied to be a part of this. It just shows that the, the willingness to compete is still there, that they know the benefits that come with us. Yeah, absolutely, you know, the, 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 it, the, let the facts do the talking. If there weren't benefits, you wouldn't have had a queue of 15 people saying we, we want it desperately. Um, so part of the frustration I have is having to let those people down and say, I'm sorry, I can't come to you this year. We will get to you in future editions. Um, but we have to choose six and, and, and we've announced those six today. And you've mentioned that this is kind of the trial run, one of the trial runs until 2019, that big race which will be coming over here. I mean, you know, it really is going to be a fantastic occasion for all. Yeah, and, they, and you know, this gives us a chance to, to test a few things, to look at potential starts, finishes, uh, uh, to look at routes, to look at some infrastructure, whether we need to do any beefing up of anything, to look at some logistical bits and pieces. So uh, when we announced the full route of the 2019 Road World Championships, if you look back over the previous editions of the Tour de Yorkshire and the Tour de France, it'll make sense. And looking at the start and finishes, which will be announced soon, how far are you in that process? Is it a case you're just crossing the I's, dotting the T's? Uh, yeah, pretty much we're 90% done in terms of the work there. UCI came for a week in July, go through those with the team. Um, some more conversations to have they'll visit again in the new year uh, in 2017 just to do any tweaks and last minute bits and pieces and then we'll be, uh, they'll be signed off and good to go and just finally talking about the Tour de Yorkshire it really is just a race which is going from strength to strength I'm very proud of the fact that the county's got a race that uh, is going from strength to strength and uh, you know, will be here in 20, 30 years' time uh, and still growing, uh, you know, in terms of its popularity and the appeal that it's having with great bike riders, men and women from around the world.